Welcome to our channel. We are Technic Force and we help grow your business online. Please hit the subscribe button to get more updates. How to use TikTok We App ByteDance, the parent company of TikTok, quietly launched We, a competitor to Instagram, in June 2024. Despite its promising features, the app is currently underwhelming. Here's why. Now, remember when Meta launched Instagram Stories and Reels, attempting to compete with TikTok and Snapchat? Well, ByteDance decided to follow in Meta's footsteps and launch an Instagram-like app. This isn't a first, though. TikTok has tried competing with Instagram before. In 2020, ByteDance launched Lemon8, a photo and video sharing platform. On the 17th of April 2024, TikTok also began rolling out TikTok Notes in Australia and Canada. According to a post on X, TikTok Notes is supposed to be a dedicated space for photo and text content. It's unclear how TikTok plans on keeping Wii and TikTok Notes distinct, since both allow users to share images with their followers. Wii is available in the App Store and Google Play Store and has already racked up over a thousand downloads. While the app is currently available in a few countries only, I downloaded the app and tested it out extensively. How does the Wii app work? The Wii app is pretty limited in terms of features and functionality. It has just three tabs, camera, feed, and messages. Let's look at what Wii does and how you can use it. Download the Wii app from the App Store or Google Play. If you search for the Wii app and it doesn't show up, then it isn't available in your country yet. Download the Wii app. Next, navigate to Wii app. Once you open the app, You'll need to rely on TikTok. You can create a standalone Wii account, and you will need to log in with your TikTok credentials. However, you can import your following or follower list from TikTok. Click Continue, and here you will need to add your friends. You can search for friends manually and send requests. We will also suggest potential matches based on how you react with other accounts on TikTok. Just click Add and send friend request. Share photos and add filters. Again, on the home page, you'll be able to see three different tabs, messages, camera, and feed. At first glance, I thought the app's interface was incredibly similar to Be Real, especially the camera. In the Wii app, you can choose from 0 0.5, 1, 2, or 3 times zoom options. By swiping, you can select filters, including emotive, light retro, CCD style, smoky, lo-fi, camping, and vintage. There is also a beauty filter option available. Choose between snapping a live photo or uploading stills from your device's photo gallery. Then browse the available filters. You can share photos with all of your contacts via the main feed or to a select number as a private message. We supports likes and comments but doesn't offer public sharing. This is in keeping with the close-knit, community-style vibe the app is going for. Like other buzzy and new social media apps, Wii's notification bell will ring whenever you receive a like, comment, or message, depending on how you've configured your notification settings. Think of Wii as a more personal version of Instagram. Unlike Instagram and most other social networking apps, Wii doesn't offer the option to have a public account. Once you log in into the app, your account will automatically be set to private, and you can only view posts to your friends share. Ultimately, this means that you can't view someone's post unless they accept your follow request. So, while this does imply that viewing an influencer or celebrity's posts on Wii is out of the question, I do think we have enough platforms for this. Wii is a platform made for you to share pictures with only your closest friends and family. We have the option to share posts with your friends on Wii or set them to only you. To do this, click on your profile and click on your post. Click on the three dots at the right side, click on privacy settings, and set who can view your post. I'm just going to choose friends. And one feature I loved about Wii is how it displays all your posts. Unlike other social networking apps, Wii displays all your images in a grid form, grouped by months. So this layout does seem quite similar to Snapchat's gallery. For instance, as shown in this image, everything I've posted in the month of July is shown under the July category. When you click on your post, your friends can react, comment, and share your post to the other platforms. To edit your profile, just click on your profile, click Edit Profile, and here you can change your image. Just click on the camera icon and choose your preferred image. Down here, you can type in your preferred name. And below your name, you will see your username. Then click Save. 
Next, in your profile section, you will see your post and your TikTok username. If you click on TikTok, it will navigate to your TikTok account. Similar to how you need an Instagram account to create a Threads account, your Wii and TikTok accounts are closely linked. Again, once you download Wii, you're prompted to enter your TikTok account's credentials to use the app. While Wii is yet to be released worldwide, it has already faced significant backlash due to this decision. Recently, many people have deleted their TikTok accounts, whether due to taking a break from social media or simply because they're no longer interested in using TikTok. Consequently, these individuals cannot use Wii without creating a new TikTok account, which is far from ideal. Another minor point I notice while logging into Wii account is that I couldn't create an account without settling a profile picture. Currently, you also can't add captions to your Wii post, and you're restricted to sharing images only. This means you can share statically pleasing videos you took with your friends on Wii. You also can see the number of followers someone else has or how many people they follow. I tested the app out with a group of friends who have a mix of Android and iPhone devices. Unfortunately, there are currently a few technical issues. I noticed that iPhone users could post images but couldn't see what others posted. If they attempted to open someone's Wii account, it would simply display their post will show up here. No matter how many times they would refresh, the same thing would happen. Conversely, Android users could both check out friends' posts and share their own pictures. So if you're an iPhone user currently and are hoping to use the app with a group of friends, you may be setting yourself up for a disappointment. Can you monetize Wii content? The Wii app doesn't currently support monetization or advertising. It's free to use and doesn't appear to be funded by ads. Is the Wii app good for brands and businesses? As we just touched on, there's no Wii monetization or advertising, nor does the app operate with a recommendation system similar to the TikTok algorithm. For this reason, it's not a workable place for brands and businesses to spend their time and money. It could always change in the future, but for now, the Wii app is a destination for casual photo sharers rather than established content creators and brands. Considering how the new app is, technical difficulties don't come as a surprise, and we do expect ByteDance to address them promptly. If you're looking for an app that offers more intimate experience than Instagram offers, I personally think Wii is something you would enjoy. The Wii app is nowhere near perfect yet, and I can say it's an app I use every day given its current set of features. However, I can picture myself using the app more often once more features are made available. Before we end this video, let me introduce to you Post Influence by Technic Force. Rank at the top of the SERPs and drive organic traffic to any niche with the only SEO strategy that still works. Get yourself and your customers free targeted traffic with guest posts on high ranking and high traffic websites. Zoom to the top of the SERPs with 100% organic link building and traffic source. Find tons of blogs and websites eager to post your articles. Get 100% organic do follow links. Only ranking sites, no bad players or dead blogs. Automated email and SMS reach out. Email and phone number of bloggers and influencers. And a lot more. Post Influence builds you backlinks and gets you new traffic with hands free ease. So, what are you waiting for? Get Post Influence now. Just go to getpostinfluence.in. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more content, and ring that notification bell. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.